Welcome back to Pipeline. This is the Billabong Crow Pipeline, and we are live from the north shore of Oahu. Call it the Seven Mile Miracle. And I would say this is the most famous wave on planet Earth. Everybody knows what Pipeline is, and we'd have nowhere to go from there. We'd have to go up to we 20. Get too, we get too emotional. 26.40 on the clock, and we start with Jackson Baker, hard-charging rookie on the 2022 oh Championship Tour. Gosh. Where is he? You can never oh look my. away because miracles happen right there, just missing out on coming out of a grinding, gurgling cavern. I hope Strider's in the lineup because I know this morning, you know, McCur, Strider, they were just touching on the fact that there's an opportunity for these guys to get deeper, to position themselves uh, a little bit better in the lineup. This must be one of the best opening rides that we've seen from a rookie. I mean, he didn't make it, but look how close he was. Yeah. You, you will get credit. Insane. You will get credit from the judges, correct? Yeah. Well, do you know what? It's going to be a low score, but it's going to be the best low scoring ride of his entire life. He just rides that mechanical ball. Look at that foam ball just nipping at his oh. heels, and that's where he gets swallowed up. Incredible vision right there. Look at him just under the peak. There's the boil. There's he's just hucking it under the hood. He makes it through so many sections, too. Does so well to keep that speed up and negotiate through it so deep. So close. Five poster moments there. And this is live action as we get straight back into it. Miguel Pupo. <laughs> See, that's why you can't write anyone off until the wave is lapping up onto the sand. Right there was a perfect example of that. Completely disappeared. Miguel Pupo, strong, stylish, goofy footer out of Brazil. That prize money, buy you some diapers. I'm going to use that old cliche. Why not? <laughs> as you see him locking into this wave. That was cool. It was cool. It was cool that he made that exit. I mean, it wasn't clean. I think the judges might dock him some points for that. But cool to watch him as he just negotiates that drop. Slows down, double arm drag. Miguel Pupo, obviously his brother Sammy making a championship tour. Look at the shift from his deck pad, that back foot all the way forward. Speed control, the pipeline is of utmost importance. Keeps getting, <laughs> keeps getting slapped at the end of these waves, but he's making them. So tricky though. You see there a lot of reverb up the face of that mid, mid-size wave. Yeah, this is uh, this is our scouting report, and it's happening live in front of our eyes. Jackson Baker, kind of a drawn-out bottom turn. The wave didn't really throw out like he expected it to, but if you can just make the drop and get to the shoulder and get back out into the lineup, you, you've you've accomplished something right there. All right, 18:30 to go. Lots of time left in this heat and lots of pipeline to surf. Tons of sets rolling through. Very consistent. Miguel Pupo right there, just on the outskirts of a guillotine, trying to eat him alive. Uh, take off on a wave yet. And I said that on purpose because I wanted to see this. Well, he has to straighten out, not the wave he wanted. Uh, Federico has had good results here on the North Shore of Oahu. 2019, he won the Hawaiian Pro. It's crazy just watching him take that quiet moment on the beach, but everyone, I mean, you feel that anticipation. We as surf fans have been waiting for a healthy John Florence to enter the arena. Uh, split peak here, Miguel Pupo up and out. Federico, I haven't seen too many backdoor waves this morning. Clean, clean wave, just an in and out, textbook surfing. You know, I love... Uh, Sometimes this event could be bittersweet in the past as the last event of the year. You're going, no, the season's over. So I like we're starting here because you get to see performances like that. Jackson Baker, rookie, you know, knowing that uh, that wasn't going to be a perfect. We'll see if the judges give that one. This is a nice looking ride for Jackson Baker. Yeah, he's really settling into this heat. Just cool to see. I mean, I think we always anticipate having that first look at the rookies. You mentioned how we've transitioned pipeline to the beginning event of the season, and there's so much that goes into being a rookie on tour. And this this first event is really going to test your men mental fortitude. Something you'll never forget. Late oh. drop stops the takeoff, but gets absolutely hammered. But guess what? Plenty of waves coming through. Federico Marias now on his back end. Textbook, textbook positioning, but just ahead of the tube there. 
But if you're a young surfer or an old surfer like myself, I, I love to just really hone in on and try to study the art of backside tube riding. Well, heat eight nearly in the books. Jackson Baker, the rookie. Well, so far the most successful rookie we've seen yet, getting the heat win here. Miguel Pupo in second, Federico Marias in third. So coming up next, get ready. John John Florence, Jadson Andre, and Zhao Chianka.